Hello everyone, it's me again, GW fan the Softcore Brony, welcoming you back to Let's Play My Little Pony Fantasy VI. So, you might be wondering what it is I'm doing back here in the room of the rather inappropriately named Impresario. Well, it's because I kind of forgot something last time. So basically, if we uh, walk over here to right about here in front of what I guess you call this tile, we can pick up uh, a tent! whoop de doo I don't know how anybody would ever figure out how to find that, but hey, it's there. Cool. Oops. Uh, hang on. Heh. <laughs> Whoops. Didn't mean to talk to that. Anyway, so I guess the only other thing I really want to say back here is that uh, if you do not have Fluttershy in your party, you can actually pick up two of these ghosts, which is still kind of a waste of time. So, anyway, woohoo! Let's get back to what we were supposed to, where we were supposed to be, over here where we've just basically sent a whole bunch of ghosts into limbo or something. So, let's move on with the quest, shall we? Oh. Wait, there's... Oh, this is what I wanted to say. Overmind! This is the only car in the whole of the... Well, in all of the uh, Phantom Train in which we can find the enemy called Overmind. That uh, may or may not be important to some of you. So, keep that in mind. And these guys are still losers. All right. Yeah, we get a green cherry for our efforts. That's good. All righty. I still don't want to fight the ghosts. Da, 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 da. Ah! Hey, it's a it's a dining car. A bright and glorious feast. Love it. Alrighty. Cool. Yeah, I guess it is. You have no fear at all, do you, Luna? Yeah, I kind of agree with AJ on that one. That is a little weird. Getting fed by ghosts. Slurp, munch, crunch, huh? Not very princess, princess uh, e manners, eh? Oh, but we get our HP and MP restored. That's cool. Well, that was pretty well worth it. Getting a free meal like that and free HP and MP back. Alright. Now that we've done that, we can actually get uh, different reactions depending on who's leading the party here. So let's check those out real quick, shall we? Yes, please. Alrighty, hurry up, ghost. I love how she's just talking to the feast like this. This is hilarious. Alrighty then. Hurry up, ghost. Alright, next. And here we have AJ's turn. Hurry up, ghost. Yes, please. Hurry up, ghost. Oop. Hurry up. Aw, oh, AJ, that's a boring response. You already said that. I love the way she stares at it while she's eating it, though. Alright, that's enough of that. Now we get to Fluttershy's turn. Hurry up, ghost. Hey, it's Angel! Ha! <laughs> Aww. How Fluttershy-ish. Wow, you wouldn't expect her to slurp and munch and crunch her food, would you? I wonder what's on that plate, anyway. Alright, hurry up, ghost. Anyway, now that we're done with our meal, you can see that uh, we can't really get past these guys here. Yeah, that's cool. So, 
Eh, might as well leave Fluttershy at the front. Fluttershy's awesome. So, we can come around this way and get this treasure here. Which we get our second set of earrings! Alright! And, strangely enough, I haven't even equipped the earrings that uh, I already had, so... Alrighty, going on. Oh, hello. And we've got a couple ghosts here. Hey! A treasure chest! Alright! Hey? What's this? Who the... Daring do? What do you mean it's yours? Well, screw you, Daring do. I've never liked you very much. Yeah, I'm not impressed either. Ooh, call the princess an ox, eh? Well, hell, them's fighting words. Let's go up against Daring Do, who has a stupidly huge sprite. All right, deathmatch against Daring Do. Oh, except Daring Do only has a hundred HP. And we only get a green cherry. How lame. And one GP. Wow, that was sad, Daring. Seriously, what was that? Hey! Hey! Ah! Oh, jerk! And we're never gonna see that treasure chest ever again. That's the worst part. Stupid daring do. And... Oh, wow. A totally empty car? What the heck? But wait! It's not quite empty, because if we stand right about here, we can pick up another tent. Uh, funny thing, technically, right here on this spot, uh, there is a fairy band, which protects us from poison and blind, but unfortunately we can't actually face this direction, so there's no way to actually acquire it. Darn original programmers. Alrighty. Moving on! Oh, on to the next car. Oh, yeah, this one actually is empty. There's nothing in there. Hey, it's you again. How'd you get up here? And you tell me the same darn thing. Why did I do that? No idea why I did that. I guess this was worth the 16 experience points. Oh, hey! Alright, check this out! You get a phoenix down, a monocle, which is sort of cool, uh, and we get a phoenix down. The monocle basically uh, lets us uh, have 100% accuracy, including with spells, so I guess that's cool. Oh, someone stuffed another monster in a box. And we get this rather lame specter enemy. Ow. Alright, Fluttershy. See, like I said, I never see Dog Block during Luna's quest. I don't know why. We can't actually stare at this enemy, by the way. Uh, it's pretty easy anyway. And we get a, another bionic hoof for it. Alright, that's cool. I can use that. Alrighty, moving on. Da, da. Oh, and if we had a go our ghost buddy, he would have left right about here. Uh-oh. A save point. Well, you know what that means. It's time to uh, change my equipment real quick, so I'll do that and I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. So, I've moved every pony to the front. Check that out. And I've changed their equipment thusly. Uh, it's very important for Fluttershy to also have a buckler here, and uh, we're set up for... Heavy offense, if you're feeling really gutsy right now, you can have Luna equipped with two earrings, so I don't really think it makes that huge a difference. Uh, otherwise, I also have uh, Luna equipped with Unicorn, just in case. So, let's go at a much slower pace. Oh well, it's just a short distance here. Hey, it's the engine room, but what do you think we gotta do? Well, if you come over here, it'll tell ya. What, what? Oh, first and third pressure valve, because, you know, this is a Square game, or Square Enix nowadays. 
And uh, they love this combination. If there's ever three switches, it's always the left and right switches. I don't know why. So now we come over here up to the smokestack where some brilliant designer decided to put the brake. Uh-oh. The Phantom Train Sentient. That's not good. And here's why we have your ponies in the front, because this is a back attack. And depending on... Oh, good. He didn't start with uh, the really bad one. If he starts with an ability called Evil Toot, well, then we'd be kind of screwed. Hey, can Luna pick up a train? Sure she can! And not because that was a particularly great ability or anything. That was just fun to do. Aye. That was close. All right, so we want Ryuinjin because it's uh, stronger than AJ's version of uh, Hadouken there. So we're basically just going to... Uh, yep, keep that up. And if our HP ever falls below 150, anyone's HP, we want to heal. Sure. Oh, by the way, Phantom Train is no longer considered undead in this version. So, it's not affected by, or you can't one-shot it with Phoenix down, but I, well, that was pretty easy. Yeah, you can't one-shot it with Phoenix down, it can't be hurt by curative items, and another difference here is that its HP has been doubled to uh, 3,800 compared to the original game, and for all that, we get a freaking tent. Really? Lame. I should mention back there, if it uses Evil Toot, it's a horrible ability that will cast a random status effect on all your party members of basically almost any status effect in the game, including Countdown. But uh, we didn't have to worry about that this time, fortunately. By the way, if that does happen, a Unicorn does not affect or does not heal you of Berserk or Screwy. I learned that the hard way. Hmm. Oh, well, hey, it looks like the exact same place we were at. Huzzah! Yeah, I'm glad you learned that, Luna. Don't get on random trains anymore. What was that? What? Wait, could it be? Betty? Fritter? Oh my gosh, the Appleites! No! Not that! Departing? No, and AJ killed Luna. What the heck, AJ? Wait! And Betty, why are you a unicorn? I mean, I thought her whole family was Earth ponies. Huh. Oh, AJ. Oh. How depressing. Poor AJ. Hey, Luna survived. All right. Well, that's quite the euphemism. Took the train. Kind of like that, actually. I can't imagine. But you just talked about how you... Hey! Oh, okay. I, I guess I had a limited time to do that. Okay. Anyway, uh, if I had talked to AJ, she just would have said dot, 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 dot. So... That wasn't really that important. Okay, anyway, uh, I'm gonna change my equipment uh, around real quick and I'll be right back. Alrighty, I'm back. And uh, as you can see, I moved everyone back to the back. Uh, we're equipped thusly. It's relatively important, I suppose. Anyway, uh, oh yeah, I've also now unequipped Unicorn. So, onwards in this relatively short, relatively short distance, and uh, we're just going up to this little cave here, and uh, 
As you can see, or not as you can see, what am I saying? Anyway, this is your last chance to fight an enemy called uh, Stray Cat around here. Uh, it may sound a little weird, but that's actually rather important. So, now that we're in this cave, we are no longer in danger of fight getting in fights with enemies, so uh, I'm actually going to change my equipment again ever so slightly. Alrighty, here we're back, and uh, as you can see, uh, we're equipped thusly. Uh, Fluttershy has nothing for a good reason at the moment, and I actually just learned something interesting. Apparently, the Knight's Oath actually gives us a uh, higher HP boost than Green Beret, even though they both say HP plus. Uh, apparently, uh, Knight's Oath is actually double plus or something. Uh, anyway, I've also... Uh, let's see, what else? I've, no, no, that's all I've done. Okay. So, here we are, Baron Falls, I guess, because... You know, they didn't have a pony pun or something. Oh, the Velt. Huh. Didn't that crazy old coot tell us about that before? Ponyville? Oh, that's awesome. Really? Ponyville's on the Velt. Um. What? Fluttershy? But Fluttershy? No! Well, he must thank you, though. You are totally best pony! Seriously, I mean, by the end of the game, she's essentially going to be a more powerful Luna. Yeah, totally, Fluttershy. You rock! We love you, Fluttershy! Dang it. Yeah, we're not crazy, so let's go. For Fluttershy! So, here's the major difference. Rather than three consecutive battles, we're gonna fight all these guys all at the same time. And, yeah. It's a lot trickier than it sounds. Aye. Yep, yeah, and that's why she's equipped with the uh, Black Belt. So, all the Piranhas have 10 HP, but one of them is the Rezo Pass, which has, which is that one, actually, conveniently which has uh, a lot more than 10 HP. All right. Hit the Rezo Pass, please. Darn it. It's dangerous. It has some nasty spells. In particular, it'll use something really bad called El Nino. Aha! Ah, huh. well, that was easy. That defeats all of them. That's cool. Oh, that was fortunate. It didn't get to use any of its really nasty spells. Alrighty. And we get a Remedy and our Red Delicious. That's cool. Hmm. Hello? Oh, wow. Seems that battle kind of knocked a lot out of us. Or maybe it was the fall from the, you know, the waterfall there. Hey, this is some nice music. And hey, that pony looks kind of familiar. Hey, did she just kick us? Oh yeah, the precocious pink party mare herself, Pinkie Pie. Oh, hey, was it you who just kicked us awake? Uh, I was just kidding about the kicking part! Oh, well. Uh, maybe we'll run into her again later. And hey, now we get this cool beat, because we're on the belt! Hey? Vector Pup? Say, didn't we meet these all the way back in, you know, Neche? With Twy? Huh. Well, that's interesting. Say, it seems we don't get experience points on the belt either. Huh, well. Huh, moral enemies. How strange. What a crazy place the belt is. Huh, hey, there's a town up here. Let's check this out. Hey! It's Ponyville! Alright! 
Well, I wonder what the deal with that, uh, you know, that, uh, pink mare out there there was. Pinkie Pie, I wonder what's her deal. And hey, what do you think we can find here in Ponyville? Find out next time on Let's Play My Little Pony Fantasy 6. Arrivederci.